the regional title game. Head coach Bob Babb, starting pitcher Gabe Romano, and infielder Jimmy Stevens. Coach, if you want to start with an opening statement, do you want to take some questions? Um, sure. We always feel pretty good when we have Gabe on the mound. And the way our offense has been uh, performing lately and hitting the long ball, um, you know, we felt confident going in. We feel like one through nine now, now that Dylan hit a home run yesterday, anybody can leave the yard. And the biggest difference is we hit balls in the air. Other teams hit balls in the ground. Um, and, you know, the balls in the ground turn into double plays. Coach, after having to go to the pen a good thing yesterday, how big was it that Gabe got through nine innings? It was huge. It was huge. And Gabe, you know, let us know he wasn't feeling 100% but he battled through, um, he was a competitor, and you know he mowed him down the last five innings when we really needed him to. Yeah, my first one goes to Gabe, so a little different than your Centennial Conference outing that you had two weeks ago. What was different between that start and this start, even though they were both complete games? Um, I mean, I always go in with the same mentality, just pitch the contact and let the defense work behind me. It's worked all year, so, I mean, I had a couple more Ks maybe like in that game, but. You know, I, I think I did my job, and I, I got those ground balls, and you know the defense did it, did the work behind me. So, Jimmy, two big swings today. How are you feeling in the box? Yeah, I felt good. I was seeing it well, uh, even on that first strikeout. You know, I felt good up there, and you know, got a couple out over the plate. And uh, when this guy's pitching, you don't need too much. So, uh, yeah, I felt good to get some out, and yeah, good day at the plate. Jimmy just missed a third home run, yeah. which I thought he had. So. Well, it, it's really nice when you look over and think, oh, well, this guy's leading off. That means we have these guys after him. It doesn't matter. You know, we uh, – all of our guys have contributed with the bat significantly, and everyone other than Dylan is hitting over 300. And Dylan has gotten a lot of clutch hit. And all those other guys have a lot of home runs to go along with it. So, as I said, we, uh, we can score at any time when one swing of the bat. And if we get a couple walks mixed in there, then we usually uh, produce a big inning. Game when you were laboring a little bit in those middle innings, how did you kind of lock back in and get those big outs to scram those guys? Oh, uh, yeah, I mean, big double play to get out of that base is loaded first. And then after that, it was just getting back in the dugout, refocusing, and then and then just working on, on staying down and, and letting letting the two seams sink and, and get ground balls. So I think it, it worked out in the end. So. And into the regional title game, we've obviously been here before. What's your message to the team as we prepare to go into the summer? Well, my message is we are going to be facing bottom line pitching, which is never good against our lineup. We have theoretically our number two ready to go. So we just got to go out, relax. I tell them, we'll go out, relax, play, play loose, play smart, but have fun. Enjoy the experience. And uh, certainly they've been doing that. Yeah, this one goes to both the players. What will you guys do to prepare for tomorrow's team? Will you watch this one here? Will you go home? What do you want to do between now and then? Well, I'm done. So. <laughs> I'm going to uh, kick my feet back and uh, get a good night's rest, but Jimmy yeah, might we'll have prepare, a Yeah, we'll prepare similarly to how we did today. Uh, you know, get some scouting report on the pitcher we're seeing and 